at Yule Moldauer on their team. And Yule is fabulous on five events, but he is really weak on high bar. He scored only a 12-4-5, and that was a hit routine. Some of the top guys in the world can fall off the bar twice and get that score. Beautiful, new skill for Akash. He was really excited to tell me that. Got a lot of releases, done in combination. Yep. Yeah, he was supposed to have connected out of that first one. So he's gonna have a maximum starting score that's a little lower than it could be, but this was fantastic. That was an absolutely great routine for him. He's on pommel horse. And I'll tell you what, I watched this live. We're looking at this slightly delayed. Sometimes he gets a little bit bent legged on some of these tricky skills. But frankly, this was fantastic thus far. And he just kept doing it throughout the entire exercise. Legs are glued together. He did his job, he hit high bar. And there's a hit on Pommel Horse. Yes, indeed. He's <laughs> in the mix, which he is. And he does come down to what they will need as a team. They have the best chance to win a medal. Not necessarily individual medals. The priority. Needs to be patient on his landings. And that one was a pretty big deduction because his chest was bent forward as well. Right there, once again, just as you mentioned, Tim, the patience. He's right there. Needs to bend his knees just a little bit. He really tried to. Spent a lot of time focusing on the execution, the landings during the pandemic when he had a little bit more time to focus on those things. Has made significant strides, but still those landings sometimes he just needs to trust himself and be patient. Another big hop. Those are three tenth hops. This isn't such a critical routine for Akash though. The next one, pommel horse. If some of the guys come off, it opens up a chance for him. There you right. go. Eight. Save the best for last, Akash. 26-year-old from New Jersey. 